Hello all you space engineers out there, Commander Kingfish here and it is day 50 here on the frozen rock and we are working on the living room. Uh, I have to apologize a little bit. I have been traveling and I'm finally set up down here in Texas and so I've uh, got everything set up and seems to be my system seems to be working pretty good with the laptop uh, hopefully everything will, will go uh, well with this but uh, it is day 50 and I am uh, working on the living area so the idea is that this will be a living area like over here and partially over here and then somewhere around over here, another couple of blocks over, uh, another couple of blocks over, I'll put a door in that goes into the kitchen area. Because if you remember, I have a entrance in down here. This goes in, this will go into the kitchen. And then you'll have access, two different access points into that living area, the kitchen, uh, the sleeping area, and the shower and bathroom areas. So I am uh, slowly working on this. So I want to get, what I want to try to get done is at least today uh, get this all hollowed out for the living area and to get the concrete blocks all in uh for this area and establish the doors that will be heading into the different areas so uh, i think with that i'm going to get started on this and i will uh, catch back up with you here in just a little bit i'll give you an update uh, once i uh, have some more of that established okay just to give you a little bit of an update uh, on where I am at. Uh, I have got this little build out. I was just grabbing some supplies so I thought I would uh, uh, chat with you as I was walking back down and so I had counted out uh, blocks from here one two three four and so I figure that that's where my door will be on here so we went one two three four and then this is the fifth block so this should actually be adjacent to that door now I'm not gonna have a corridor out to the hallway because I'll have the one there and then I'll have the one down on there so this is just gonna be a door into the kitchen and I actually might put that over uh, say over about here to put the door just to have a little bit of an offset and uh, that should take care of that so I've built scaffolding around here so I could get up to the roof and so I've been able to clear out the roof and start putting blocks in there so uh, that's where I have gotten actually and then then I've kind of figured out that this is my hallway going into the back facilities to the bedrooms and the uh, restrooms and that sort of thing so back and in here so let's see so I think uh, I'll continue to build out and I'll give you another update as soon as I get some more of this built out just but just wanted to keep you updated on it All right, I just put my last roof piece in, or at least wise for this section, my last roof piece. So I should be able to take out all of these girders, and then I should be able to work from down here. So let's do that. And we'll get these out of here. And then... There we go. So now you get a feel. This is going to be a fairly large room, but it's going to be a gathering room, uh, that sort of thing. So uh, 
I'll have, uh, you know, facilities, uh, maybe a pool table, something like that in here. Uh, there'll be some uh, monitors, television screens set up, and this way the uh, guys can kind of sit back and relax. So one of the things that I've done is built this up, and so now the company wants to send more people over here. So once I get the facilities put together, then they can start sending more people over here, and we can start mining more of the resources. And... Uh, screw up this planet's economy and environment and whatnot as good humans that we are anyway i uh, just wanted to give you an update let me go grab some more blocks uh so that we can kind of fill this up it'll probably be a little shorter than normal video i'll probably cut it off here pretty soon in that uh i've got to try to uh limit the size of the videos that i upload uh, I have to go over to my nephew's place because here at the campground I don't have very good internet. Uh, it's good enough to, to game and whatnot, but to upload uh, files, it just, it's not going to happen. So that's what I'm kind of in the process of kind of working out. So this, again, this will be a little bit shorter video. Uh, I'll try to fill it in with some uh, stuff here and there. And uh, as I f get more of this room done down here, I'll give you another update. But uh, let me kind of just show you what I have in mind. Uh, it, uh, I think I'll have to put another, well, I'll probably have, uh, this will probably be solid because I'm not going to have windows into the private areas like the, the sleeping quarters and whatnot. That would be a little little odd, but uh, I probably, well, I went ahead and put the wall in there, but I think, uh, we'll see. I might put another window in right here, uh, just like I did over there. And then uh, this area probably will put benches and whatnot. Uh, we'll have a pool table and stuff down here. And then uh, there'll be seats and tables and stuff scattered around in here. All right, well, that's a little bit of an update. As soon as I get some more of this done, uh, I'll give you another update. Well, I see a unknown signal that's actually pretty close over here. Let's go. Uh, let's go see what we can find in it. It's real close, so usually if they land that close, I usually run over there and uh, grab them and see what's in there. We haven't done one of these in a while, so why not? Uh, let's see what we get out of it. Uh, probably we'll get some stuff for the farming, uh, food production and a few metal plates but mostly it's just the scrap that we grind down out of there that helps uh, add a little uh, material so uh, let's uh, see it's all we got 10 minutes it's not going to explode on us I could have hopped in one of the vehicles but by the time I run over there and hop in a vehicle and get going and get over there then I probably could have run there and, and back so uh, sure let's uh, let's see what we got all right, we're closing in on it. I made sure I was uh, my uh, backpack was empty and that I had plenty of energy before I ran over here. Knowing our luck, it'll be one of those uh, roly-poly things. But I haven't gone after one in a while, so usually, let's see what we got. Well, we're good. All right, let's. Uh, All right, well, let's, uh, great, wastewater, coffee, and some power, what's that, power kits, all right, uh, where is our, is that it, nope, oh, it's down below, isn't it, let's push this thing over, come on, push over, all right, so let's uh, 
Let's take... Come on. There we go. Take that out. We should be able to push it over now. Come on. Over. Over you go. There. Oh, come on. You were there. Come on. Come on. There we go. All right. Now let's see what we got. All right. Leopard boots. To go with the other hundred pair of leopard boots that I have. I wish they'd add some new things in that. That would make it a little more interesting. But I've got way more of that stuff than I will ever need or use. Matter of fact, I haven't even bought a or bought. Haven't even made a medical facility yet. And that's probably something that uh, I need to put down down below, which will probably be off the control room side of things. So that's probably where we'll put some medical facilities. Because we, we really don't have anything. We, all we've got is the survival kit that uh, we managed to save and keep alive and got it into the garage there. So, uh, yeah, i got to consider a medical room as well. Because that uh, control center is rather big on that one side. And I'll have like a couple of entrances into that. So I could put a medic easily put, uh, I'll have plenty of room to put a medical facility over there. So I would have a, uh, a med bay and, and some beds and uh, stuff like that in there. So, all right, uh, we get back to base over here and dump this stuff off. Uh, let's see, I gotta grab some supplies. All right, well, I thought you guys might just, it'll be, a, that was a little bit of a break, so I thought I would uh, just uh, uh, kind of let you see that, uh, kind of get a little more on the video, and to give a chance to, to kind of see what, what I do when I'm off camera. So, let's, uh, let's get over here, and once I get a little farther along, I'll uh, give you uh, another update. All right, well, just an update and probably going to wrap up the video right here. I know it's going to be a little bit shorter, but I've got some commitments this afternoon, so I'm not going to get as far along as I was hoping to, but at least I got a video made. So here's what I've done. I've, I've got, <clears throat> this is going to be a door and then a hallway into where the sleeping quarters and the restroom and the facilities and that sort of thing is. This is going to be a door right here heading into the kitchen area and uh, that will uh, uh, that way they can have kitchen and a dining area in here. And then uh, again as I mentioned uh, there will just be some uh, pool tables, gaming area, that sort of thing here in the living area. So. That's about it for this week's episode. Uh, I know I have missed a few. Uh, I did get some more lights up and in here. And so I got two more lights up. So that's uh, got a pretty nice lighting here in this area. So I, I kind of like that. All right. Well, if you like the video, please hit that thumbs up. It really helps out the video. And uh, please subscribe. That really helps out the channel. Uh, and uh, with that, well, you, all you space engineers, keep building away out there. And with that, Commander Kingfish is out of here, and I will see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone.